We have brain cells in our heart and in our gut. So you know when someone says, trust your gut? It's because there are brain cells in your gut. So the brain is not just this thing that, oh, well, you know, are you smart? You have a big brain or you're a brainiac. If you're a brainiac, it could mean also you're very people savvy. You really understand relationships. Anybody here ever had a very, very strict teacher or somebody who you're with who scared you? It was impossible to learn because we're so wired to be able to feel that warm fuzzy on the right side. If that stuff gets blocked, that voice goes across and goes, I can't hear what she's saying, and you block it out. <laughs> Hands up. This, I'm going to show you a very crude but easy model of the brain, and you can impress your friends at home. Tuck your thumb in, fold it over. That, my friends, is your brain. Check this out, OK? This is the brain stem. This here is the midbrain. Lift your hand. This thumb is the midbrain. That's where your limbic system is. That's emotion and motivation and memory and attachment. So this limbic system is huge because that's where all our emotions lie. Now tuck it over. This is the front of the brain. That's your higher thinking, your rational mind. That's what makes you go, you know what? I I think that's not such a good idea. <laughs> the front of the brain is what keeps you rational. Is that your conscience? Very interesting question. Katie asked, is that your conscience? We've actually found in brain scans that morality is mediated in the front of the brain. Amazingly, so is empathy, so is intuition, so is the ability to calm yourself when you're scared. 